Hello everyone, and welcome to another episode of Clash on Clashington. I hope everyone enjoyed the holiday season and is enjoying the new year. For alongside that, we'll be moving on to the weekly update. Now before we premiere the 5 brand new cards we have in store, we would like to introduce a new mechanic to the game of Clash, and it is called Buffy Damage. The way how buffy damage works is if a minion is dealt buffy damage equal to or greater than their buffiness in a single turn, they become unconscious. Buffy damage does not lower a minion's buffiness, and all buffy damage is removed from minions at the end of each turn. As an appropriate method of introducing this new mechanic to Clash on Clashington, we at Home Brewery would like to reveal 5 new cards this week that implement this mechanic. Aside from this, we are also planning on releasing a new Fixed vid very soon that will alter some previous cards to use buffy damage instead, such as Rabble Rouser and Cannonball Buster. There will also be a lot of changes to some cards, and although most of them are just textual changes that will not affect the function of the cards, there are still a few that have to be tweaked. Above all, keep a look out for this Fixed video, because it's going to be very important. On one final side note, you may also notice that the cards released in this video, which are events, are labeled as basic events. The reason why they are labeled as basic events is because this is an update in the, or at least will be an update in the following fixed vid that basically just states any card that isn't an item or anything else special will just be labeled that instead for the use of certain cards. I just thought it was something worth mentioning in this video in order to prevent confusion. Alright, so now we have all that rambling out of the way, it is time to reveal the new cards. Starting off this week, we got POW. POW is a straightforward buffy damage mechanic card that allows you to deal 10 buffy damage to a minion in the Clashington it is played, at the cost of zero actions. It is the simple kind of card that gives you what you want, when you want it. Following POW is its bigger brother, per se, with BAM. Need a little more firepower? At the cost of an action, BAM will give you just that. At 15 buffy damage dealt to a minion in the Clashington it is played in, Bam is capable of knocking out most level 1 minions by itself. Up next is Smack. Do not be fooled by the small amount of buffy damage this card deals, for if you look close its effect can target any minion in any Clashington, regardless of where it has been played. It is a more versatile alternative to POW that some quirky commanders may find useful when partnered with other combos. After that is Whack, the bigger brother to Smack. This is the last basic event that will be introduced this week, and it is essentially a mix between Smack and Bam, where versatility and power blend together. Like the other buffy damage cards, it isn't essential to knock an extra minion out when pulling off crazy combos. Lastly for this week, we have a level 2 minion that is pretty much Rabble Rouser's little sibling, Bruiser Baddy. Although not as strong as Rabble Rouser itself, Bruiser Baddy benefits the board by offering a wider variety of placement on the field. Ultimately, it is a variant of the current Rabble Rouser that may benefit Clash Commanders more than its original counterpart. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoy these new cards, and tune in soon for the Fix It vid because there's going to be a lot of stuff discussed in that video that will be very important. Until then, I wish all of you Clash Commanders out there the best of luck, and keep on clashing.